today we're going to do a tune-up or a valve adjustment on a Series 50 Detroit uh, diesel. The way you do that is uh, first I would uh, check which one is the intake and which one is the exhaust valves. So a good easy way of checking which one the exhaust is, is looking at the turbo. The turbo is going to take exhaust, so this is exhaust, so you know this is your exhaust manifold. Then you look at which valves are closer to that exhaust. These valves seem to be closer to this exhaust uh, manifold, so I, this would be your exhaust valves. Now, this is the intake manifold, and these valves here, these valves here are closer to the intake manifold. Now, if you notice here, the rocker arm has a, a dual setup where it has two valves um, being actuated by one arm here, and same thing for the intake. And this other one here is the uh, injector. Um, uh, it's it's the arm for the injector. So first. What we would do is we would bar the engine over, bar the engine over, and what you're looking for is the companion cylinders. On this engine, it's one, I'm sorry, uh, one and four, and two and three. Those are companion cylinders. So it would be one and four, and then two and three. So you bar the engine over into this cylinder is at top dead center and this cylinder is also going to be at top dead center the difference is going to be that this cylinder is not firing this cylinder is on overlap this cylinder is firing so that means that you can adjust this cylinder so when we adjust it we use feeder gauges that go between this area here this area here is going to give you, um, for the exhaust, it's 26 thousandths of an inch. And for the intake, it's 8 thousandths of an inch. With a feeler gauge, you would put it in here and see if you could, um, if, you, if, if your measurements are correct. Okay, now, once you've adjusted these, you could go ahead and actually adjust the the injector and the way the way you adjust the injector is is with this tool here it's called the it's called the injector height gauge and what happens is you have a little hole here and you're able to you're able to get the height of the injector and that's how you adjust the injector basically you move on every time you on this one you would do one whole turn and then now you could adjust the 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 two and three cylinders which are companion and that's how you do a, a valve adjustment or a tune-up